Welcome back to Dallas Sports. Today we've got a short video for you and it's all to do with catching and passing. Okay, in the past we used to make videos just about passing, but today it's catching and passing. We're breaking it down five letters. We're going to use the word clap. Okay, now the word clap is spelled C L A P, right? But we're going to add another P and I'll show you why. The first one, C, stands for to catch, the L stands for to look. And the A is to aim where you're gonna pass, okay? And then the P is obviously pass, and then the second P is to point. So this is what it is. You break down every letter, spend five minutes on it, and then all in all, it should add up to about 25. You can add another five on top of that if you just keep working. First one, I'm just gonna focus on catching. Yes, Caleb. Okay, if I'm running that way. Just focusing on catching, okay? Okay? Okay, notice where I'm catching the ball. I'm not catching it in front of my body, I'm catching it on the inside shoulder. Because if I catch it on the inside shoulder, okay, it, it gives me time on the ball. If I catch it in front of me, that means I'm gonna have to take a few extra steps before I can actually get the ball away. Or I'm gonna force the pass okay as soon as it's on the inside shoulder okay the next step it will allow me to get the ball away right right the right. next one let's focus on catching the ball and then looking okay yes Caleb and then look again yes Caleb catch and then look so I'm looking here here's my target there's my target, okay? So I'm just practicing, catching, yes Caleb, and looking. All right, notice my feet is square and in line with my hips and my shoulders. My, my knees are bent like I'm in athletic stance, like I'm running. So imagine I'm running that way, catching it early, yes Caleb. Catch, and then look. All right, one more. Yes Caleb, catch and then look. All right, so now we're going to focus on We've just done clap or catch, look, and now aim. We're going to aim. Yes, Caleb. Catch, look, and then aim. All right, aim. And again, yes, Caleb. Catch, look, and then aim. Okay, one more. Catch, look, and then aim. Okay. Now, a lot of times you'll hear coaches say, make sure you look up, play with your eyes open. What does that mean? I'm not playing with my eyes closed. Play with the eyes up. So this is what you should be doing. You catch it, okay? You look, and then you aim. So where are you looking? You're looking up, and then you aim for the target. So catch, look, aim. Yeah, right. Me. So the next one, we're going to pass the ball. We're going to catch, we're going to look, we're going to aim and we're going to pass the ball. Right, here we go. Yes, Caleb. Catch, look, aim, pass. Okay, you'll be spending five minutes on that. Off your right hand and off your left hand. Okay, and again. Yes, Caleb. Catch, look, aim, pass. Okay, one more. This time we're going to use a basketball. Okay, okay drop that one. Okay, so it's good to use a round ball because it's uh, it's a good it's a different form, okay, different feeling. So you're practicing fingertips as well. Ten pressure points will come closer. Yes, Caleb. Catch, look, aim, okay, and pass. Okay, so now the next one would be after catch, clap, aim, pass. You have to point. So here's the next one. Follow me, okay? So if there's anything, just as usual, uh, put it in the comments below. All right, you might already use this. Please share your experience and how you do things. But check it out, point. All right, so catch, look, aim, pass, and point. Okay, those are the things that we'll be looking at. Right, the next one, we're going to do this, but we're gonna move into the ball. Yes, Caleb. Closer. Okay, so I'm going to, as if I'm running, but I'm just walking, breaking it down, catching and passing. Okay, it's important to drop your 
shoulder when you're passing and then stay square as you're moving okay so first one catch early yes Caleb okay and then pull yes Caleb catch early pass okay stay square one more uh, rugby ball please okay so this time we're using a rugby ball same thing so my hips and my shoulders my outside foot is forward hips shoulders towards the ball so I can catch it early okay here we go there you go it's always good to have a target you know when you have a target is something you can see especially if you don't have extra hands or someone that can help you out if you're just at home you can practice catching it early and then passing it against the target okay I'm gonna do this one more time with the ball right catching and passing right watch here we go Caleb so on the go you're running yes Caleb catching early Boom. okay yes Caleb okay just like that catch and pass if you spend 25 30 minutes at a time you you should see that your passing will improve okay um, and also make sure you have fun with it um, I know some people are really skilled now they're good at offloading they're good at passing but I thought we'll just make a short video to share you know catch it early look pass because that's still part of the game that will always be part of the game get it on the rib punch it out straight arm and follow through okay we hope you like this video um, as usual keep subscribing keep sharing and we would like to say thank you to everyone who's taking the time out to watch all our videos and to share them and to support us um, hopefully you feel inspired uh, and we'll see you next time take care